Hey guys, it's me and number 19 here. Um, my hair's a little wreck right now. I just got out of the shower. But this is a video I've never done. And if you hear that, like, scratching, it's my dogs, like, going off their cage. Over there, I think you might be able to see them. So, yeah, that's them. Uh, you've seen the cage, so there's dogs in it, trust me. <clears throat> so this is a 10 gallon for a leopard gecko. It is perfect for him. A uh, 10 gallon is what he's going to stick with for his whole life. The screen lid, as you can see, um, just take it off. He's tame to me, so it's alright. I mean, it's hard to tame these guys with the screen lid, because imagine if you were a baby leopard gecko, or adult really, and you're new to this environment, and a giant hand just comes up and picks you up. The doors are pretty cool, but the 10 gallon screen lid is pretty good. I like it. I think I like theirs more than the doors, so. This stick is really just for decoration. I found it in my backyard and decided to add it and I leans up against that. Like the stick goes. So of course I cleaned it and everything. I cut the sharp edges off so you can't really get cut by it. He doesn't use it much. But there's his water dish. I mean if you can see it. <clears throat> There it is, like, right there. I tried, I got a big one. They don't really need that. I, they don't need that <clears throat> big of one, but I want to make it as natural as they, um, it can, as I can. And they come from the desert, so I added, like, it would be kind of like a little puddle to them in the desert. Of course, I use reptile carpet. I think I mentioned that before. If you can see, there's his hide. I have a little log thing in there that he absolutely loves. So I am not planning on getting rid of that anytime soon. He is <clears throat> little enough for it, and even when he gets to be an adult, he'll still be able to get in it. He always hides under it. He's an active gecko. Uh, I did find out his morph. It's a tug snow, and if you can see his tail just in there, I don't think I'm going to be able to get him right now, but just wanted to show you that he does like to hide in there. If I can put it back in. Yeah, I got it. Okay, it's a pretty heavy one. Let me grab his food dish. The little food dish. It's perfect for him. I feed him mealworms with calcium, as you can see the white powder. If you can see the mealworms in there. Little like food dish tray. Perfect for him. Um it leans up it's like rounded off, so I put it right on the steps of his water dish he does like to get in his water dish kind of swim around in it which is surprising because most of them don't like to do that um <clears throat> the fake plants on here pretty good um it makes this more natural like the log he likes to hide in there i don't know if you guys have that and i forget where i got it from but it's really good hide. I like it for him. I mean, the fake plants are really sturdy. Don't come off. This is a 10 gallon, of course, if you can see that. With the screen lid right here. So, it's perfect. If you have cats, I recommend a lid or the doors. I don't want to, I wouldn't leave it open because I have cats. I have three. So I, I don't, I have the screen wood. So let me put a stick back down. He doesn't use the stick often. But, you know, they don't really like to, if some of them do and some of them don't like to climb. But I use Repti, Repto Calcium. 
Reptile is what they call it on here, but it's reptile calcium. For all reptiles, uh, if you can see that, for all reptiles, that's perfect. Um, powder nutrition supply um, includes calcium and vitamin D, C, so that's good. Uh, I'll open it up and show you what it looks like. You guys probably already know what it looks like. Whoa. Let me just... It's like white powder. Let me... Okay, there you go. See how it is on my finger? It's just white powder. Try not to really get... It sort of, it doesn't smell the best, but you know, if you're going to have reptiles, you got to make the commitments to have what they got to have, so I do that because I love my leopard gecko. Um, you know, you need a water dish and a food dish, um, of course a hide. I know you need two hides, but this hide has multiple hides in it, it's a like, a cave or a tunnel system in it inside so it's like has like five hides in there that he can just hide in so I don't really need um two I mean I don't know if I would be able to fit two in there just because of this water dish takes up a lot of room but I mean he has plenty of room he I think he it's good for him I think this um this setup that I have for him is really good it is amazing. I once I first set it up, I was like, "Oh my god!" I this is actually new, if you can tell. Um, the the reptile carpet. If I can get you, it's fresh because I just got it yesterday. I had to make a little pet store spree, so I got him a new thing of calcium. His water dish was. His uh, food dish was like a little worn out, wore out, so I got him a new food dish, new um, repti reptile carpet, and a new thing of calcium. This is what I use. It's perfect for them. So that's good. Um, let's see. Have I covered all the basics? You need to have a heating pad, but mine's downstairs right now. I don't have it hooked up under the cage. I mean, this isn't a new setup. I've had him for over... Well, he's about 11 months, and I got him when, the, when he was a hatchling. So I've had him for about 11 and a half months. So, I mean, close to a year I've had him. The heating pad is downstairs, and I took it out for this video. I don't know why. Um, but, yeah, you, you need to have the food dish. If you're going to breed, I, you, sh you should use calcium to get them bigger and stuff. As you can see, you don't really need a calcium dish. Um, I put the calcium in the food dish, covers the mealworms, and I put some, a good bit to the side too, just so we can... Yeah. So, it's a pretty nice little food dish. I got it for about five, I got it for about five bucks at my local pet store. Yeah, I got this for about four, I think, four bucks. So, they don't really have that much requirement. Got the repto carpet for about... I think I got it for about seven bucks, so I got this hide for like twelve bucks. So and I got this water dish for about I think I it was like ten. So yeah. See you guys. That was a good setup, so see ya.